Uh, you know what? I'm sorry. Can we just look at the ring again? God please, damn. Please. Please do. God damn. Look at that fucking it's thing. It's majesty. It's majesty, sir. Holy shit, man. Mm. Mm. It makes me want one. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. It oh, makes yeah, me yeah. feel like I want to get one. Mm. Mm -hmm. But, you know, there's lots of things that I want out there. It doesn't necessarily mean I'll get them. Like this right here. Look at this. SpaceX's private Inspiration4 mission is a go for launch on September 15th. And I will attempt oh. to live stream that launch into the Discord, as we have done before with space launches, if we have the opportunity to do so. If you don't know about Inspiration4, it's all uh, uh, civilians, I guess, would be the right term. It's regular people. They're not... That's cool. Uh, yeah, it's not astronauts or whatever. You know what I mean? They're they're sending. Yeah. If you remember, a couple of years ago, when they started prepping for this, uh, there was this guy who gave a bunch of money to Elon and said, "I want to buy up all the tickets for this one particular uh, civilian mission, and what I want to do is give them away. I think it's twenty, if I'm not mistaken. Give all those away." to artists and musicians and writers and, uh, you know, people that create mm -hmm. and send them up there. And you know what I mean? If there was ever a fucking scenic setting that might inspire you to create something <laughs> great, fuck yeah, put them in space, man. Hell yes, man. That's inspiration on tap right there. I believe there. it. I believe it. Very fucking cool. And I'm looking forward to kind of keeping an eye on that, see what those people come up with or what comes of that. What I will say is they're training... It's pretty fucking minimum compared to regular astronauts. Hope none of them die during the launch, dude. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I mean, oh, that's, you always kind of hope that, right? I, I, well, yeah, that's this true. I'm just first saying. You're hoping that that's the case, right? Well, I mean, I'm just, I'm just saying I hope that they're ready for something like that. Not everybody's ready for something like that, man. Not everybody could have some kind of mentally fucking focused powers they could use to make sure that the spice must flow, bro. But... Sometimes you figure it out anyway. Dune is the jaw-dropping sci-fi epic you've been waiting for. Yeah, I've already seen it. Uh, <laughs> right, the first time, yeah. yeah. yeah I, we, I, we're I not waiting did. for it anymore. It already happens. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not waiting for Dune. I mean, am I wrong, dude? Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> Yeah. You're just an asshole. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just saying, man. By the way, I just took a quick look over at the Metro. My man Stone Monkey posting up with his Monk? fucking golf gear swag out there. Whatever he's yeah. doing today. Appreciate you, Monkey. Glad to see you out there, buddy. And, of course, you can get killer stuff for yourself like that, too. Golf-gear.com. And Duel's just on top of it with the chat. Boom. It as Beautiful. Well. That is Beautiful. nicely done. Why he's employee of the month, you That's know? Why he's employee of the month, man. You know? Goddamn. Mm -hmm. It's because you find problems when they happen and you solve them quickly. You don't wait years and years and years and wait till it stacks up to, to the point that the problem becomes the norm to finally go, we should see what's going on here. Meanwhile, the federal government is looking into McDonald's ice cream machines. Really? What? What? <laughs> Oh my God! What? Their their ice cream machines have been broken for so goddamn long. We gotta spend tax dollars on it, man. Jesus, that's Christ. ridiculous, man. That is ridiculous. But you know, uh, I, it, it's Do a racket. People want McDonald's that bad? It's not good. You know what I mean? Their ice cream. They apparently want the either. ice cream. Yeah, man. But I mean, even with the even if they fucking found some shit and locked some people up and made it to where okay, now the ice cream machines should work. They're still the employees are still not gonna want to clean them, and when they don't clean them is when they claim that they're well, broken. Uh, that's a hundred percent accurate. I think that they're gonna waste our tax dollars to find out that after ten o'clock, when the employees have done their cleaning for the night, they don't want to fucking make your one shitty shake in order to have to re-clean that whole machine, which is a pain in the ass. It's what they're gonna find out is they're not broken. You know what I mean? Yup. 
Uh, never were. <laughs> uh, you know what? I, I'm going to take a turn on this. Fuck that. It's about time that the federal government put my tax dollars <laughs> to a use I care about because I'll be damned if people that wait in line in the middle of the night to get the worst goddamn petroleum byproduct milkshake they can possibly drink have to answer to employees who won't make it for them. Thank God You're damn the right. federal when I... government is finally doing something that matters, man. When I want my my McSlurry, I want it now, and I want it fresh. You're I want it from a clean, right. unbroken machine, and damn it, it's the government's job to make sure those places provide such a Yeah, service. shouldn't the government control private industry? That'll make everything what else are they, run smoother, what else are right? They doing, Look how know? efficient the federal government is with everything else. Mm. Okay, I can't keep mm. that joke up. It's too it, hurt, it hurts. Yeah. It hurts on the inside.